What's good, YouTube? It's Lights Out from Madden Daily, and in this video, I'm going to show you our QB sneak slash power roll fourth and one defense, which is in our defensive ebook that we just dropped a couple days ago. Also, before I get into that, I would like to use this video as our feedback video for everyone that purchased the guide. So, everyone watching this now, if you bought the defensive ebook, we would really appreciate it if you could drop your feedback on here really quick. That way, any potential customers that may be on the fence about purchasing it can see what everyone thinks about it. And if you didn't buy the book and are watching this now, but you've purchased one of our books before or have been a sub with us for a while and support what we do, we would really appreciate it if you could drop a like on this video. Someone has been buying negative likes on some of our videos, so as they spend money for no reason to hate on what we do, it would be nice if we could get as many likes as possible on our videos, and especially this one. Before I get into the QB Sneak D, I'm going to briefly show what the defensive ebook looks like. We covered 12 formations and 33 plays total, and that's not including the intro video in which many people feel like that video alone is worth $20. We also broke down when and why to call each play, and every single play in our ebook has a written breakdown, screenshots, and a video at the bottom. This upcoming week, we're going to update both the KC and defensive ebook with gameplay videos and commentary so you can see exactly how we go about using the plays and schemes. Remember to drop your feedback here when you get the chance, and thank you everyone for continuing to support us. By the way, for the guys that have iOS Mavericks and want to buy the ebook, send us an email to maddendaily at gmail.com. We promise to keep delivering the best ebooks and free tips out. Thank you. Here in this video, we're looking at QB sneak defense, and the formation we're checking out is Nickel Strong. The play is called Sugar Blitz. A lot of people already use Sugar Blitz in the Madden community. What they do is they'll pinch the D-line right away, run commit, and take that free safety and bring them all the way down to the box. And if they try to QB sneak, they should not get even a yard. Sometimes the quarterback won't even hurdle, and if it's fourth and one, you're going to get the stop. Although it's really good QB sneak defense, it cannot stop the power row or the play action. Another negative thing about the defense is that when someone comes out in QB sneak and then audibles to power row or any other play, the linebackers are going to actually spread out, as you can see in the clip. Then if you go back and reset the play to the QB sneak, a lot of times you will actually be able to get at least a yard, maybe more. So we twerk the defense a little bit. We're still using the nickel strong sugar blitz. However, we're going to do things a little different. We're still going to pinch the line right away. However, what we're going to do is if in the goal line formation, if they're strong to the right, if they don't come out in it flipped, there's two tight ends right, we're going to shift the linebackers right. And as you can see, we still stop the QB sneak. Again, we're pinching the line. We see that it is not flipped, so we're going to shift the linebackers right, bring the safety down, run commit. And here they're trying the power row, and unlike the other setup, it will stop the power row. That's because we're shifting the linebackers to the strong side. Also, if you come out in QB sneak, audible to power row, the linebacker in the middle is not going to move. So if they go back to the QB sneak, it will get stopped. Or if they do the power row, again, it will get stopped as well. If they come out in goal line flipped, all we have to do, again, is pinch the line, bring the safety down, run commit, but we're going to shift the linebackers left. We'll still have that right middle linebacker in the middle, and the other linebacker will be to the left. If they run a power row to the left, it will get stopped, and so will the QB sneak. Versus the play action, you're either going to get a sack if you run in with the safety, or you could just manually play back. I believe you're on the fullback. So if you see the fullback in the flats, run at him or jump any route that's open. Overall, we truly feel like this is the best fourth and one defense in the game. It could stop the QB sneak, the power row and is pretty decent against the play action. If you're struggling on defense and you need help in Madden 25, you'd be crazy not to purchase this defensive ebook. It's the best defensive ebook you'll ever purchase and arguably our best ebook in general that we've ever put out. I really hope you guys enjoy it. The link is in the description. Buy it now for $19.99. Till next time, later.